have a material witness on an aggravated battery. Hello, Gamer Nation, SKS here with another game series. Well, it may be a series. It really just depends on how much you all enjoy this and if you like the rough edges that it's showing right now or not. But we're going to play Enforcer Police Crime Action. This game was donated to me by someone. Not someone, but the actual person, someone. Um, and I think it's got me addicted to police simulators, so we could be in trouble. Um, I played this a little bit. I'm going to start a new career. I uh, I messed around with the character I called Joe Simpson because I always make up random people. But we'll start a new one. Now you have to remember this game is a lot to do, and it has so much, I guess, available that it could be it's a diamond in the rough. But they have to polish it, polish it a lot. Let's see what we're going to do. Normal mode. In normal mode, the player cannot really die. They will respawn at the hospital when dead and will lose score. Also, there can only be one mission at a time. Realistic mode. The challenge is much higher because there will be up to three missions at the same time and the player will lose their character when they die. You know what? Fuck it. Let's do realistic. Uh, we'll be male. And we will be officer. Uh, you know... Who are we named after? Uh, let's, uh, let's be, uh... Let's be Abe. Abe Johnson. That sounds like a good name. Good cop name. But anyway, back to what I say while I'm doing this is... The people who are working on this game, how much more work they'll do into it, I don't know. I hope they put a lot more because... The game is very, 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 very rough around the edges. Um, the driving is terrible still. Uh, the commands are kind of buggy, the animations are bad, but as we play it, you'll see what I'm talking about, that there's a lot that could happen. My father was an exceptional police officer. Oh. He caught criminals better than a dog can catch a frisbee. Yeah. My sister and I grew up in the big city. Shortly after my father died, my mother began to suffer from several health problems. She has since recovered and lived in a small town like I did. Like I do. Today we discovered that drug dealers have set their base of operations in these small towns. As there are only a handful of police officers, we have to work in shifts each day to provide round-the-clock cover. On the upside, at least I can visit some old friends and my mother who lives close to Mountain Valley. So we're in Mountain Valley. We're going to be a cop here. The bus, for some reason, drops us off right at our house. That's always a good thing. Yes, yes, yes. So this is our house. Here's the map. Uh, this is uh, the valley, so to speak. If I zoom out, you can see all the areas. Now, the problem is, is they're divided into seven different areas. So, while it looks like Grand Theft Auto, not so much. Um... So like I said, uh, it's 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 really rough around the red the ridges, but uh, we'll see. All right, so I got my suitcase. Somehow I can hear my uh, my uh, police thing in the car. My radio. I don't know why I forgot what a radio is. Oh, and now it's raining. Now one thing you're gonna notice with the lightning is, and if you move around too much, is sometimes it rains in the house. Now if you look around, the house looks like crap. You actually have the ability to go to your computer and you can buy things and upgrade stuff but for right now um, I, don't, I don't need any of this I mean it's just you know I mean I'm sure they could expand on that I mean it leaves it open to where it could be like Grand Theft Auto you could you know buy bigger houses and stuff, but the area is really, really, really tiny right now. Um, so you kind of just have to uh, go with it. Uh, they got kind of a system here where you talk to your friends and your mother. Did you see the rain come in there? Yeah, there it is again. Uh, so yeah, again, that's, uh, I think it's three people working on this game. 
But, uh, let's see. Hello, my dear. I hope you do well in your new town. In the past, these small towns were very peaceful. Now we have gangs and other criminals all over the streets. Please take care of yourself. Oh, when you have some time, come visit me and also your grandparents. They are missing you. They are also very not very well, so it'd be nice to see them soon. Life is hard sometimes, but God is always with us. God bless you, your mother. George. Hello. I hope your trip was good. I know you want to be alone right now, but since I promised your father to take care of your family, I wanted to help. Left the police car in front of your new house so you can get to the police station faster. Since this is your official vehicle, there's no problem in using it now. Remember, you can only drive the squad car while on duty. I think it's good that you go to the police station right after starting your first shift just to get to know everything in there. See, I misread this earlier and thought it said everyone, so I thought, oh, you'll go down there and see people. Nope, there's nobody else. Let me know if you have any problems. Cheers. Alright, so I guess that's my mother. And... I don't know. Uh, this is a picture of me and that girl that was on the bus, but I guess I left her. And I don't know who that is. But anyway, you know, this 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 is our bathroom. You know, which has lots of windows in it, which is creepy. That shower doesn't even look like big enough for it. Here's our bed. Uh, you can look down the bottom right. It is midnight. Actually, it's not midnight. It's two o'clock. Time runs really fast in this game. I'm not a fan of it. Let's go ahead and get four hours sleep. And we'll wake up and we'll start our shift. But, uh, like I said, there's some things they need to change. I feel like the shift goes too fast. Let's go on duty. Is it still raining? It is, so we'll put our jacket on today. Because I'm nuts over this. Now, I am definitely a bad cop. I fucking go crazy. Now, if you look up there on the top right, it's got my name, it's got how much money I have, how, how my health, and then you got your hunger, your energy, and I've still not figured out what the third one is. Um, so, maybe, you know, later on that will help. Alright, we have a new mission. Make a roadblock on the streets and check the vehicles. Check for vehicles with problems. Okay. All right, so let's get in. Turn our car on. We need to put our headlights on, and let's head to town. Actually, I could have just made the roadblock down here, but nah, we'll go into the city and do that. Look at that, my car's up to 60 miles per hour, 70 miles per hour, super fast. There's, like I said, there's some things they've got perfect. But then there's things they don't have. Let's, uh, let's set up our roadblock like right here. Alright. I think, yeah, we'll have to do traffic cones here. And we'll see if anybody comes through. Hey. Okay, you asshole. Obviously, I need more traffic codes. I didn't want to get in. But I can't turn my stupid signal light off. There we go. Oh, it's not going to let me put anymore. more. That sucks. I never had to do the traffic cone thing before, but uh, we'll see what happens here. Should I find a bigger... Let's find a... Uh... Uh, what's the job you have at that location? Because nobody is coming this way, and that makes me mad. Alright, let's actually move up here to where we can find a busier outlet. Let's go in the middle of town. Alright. Let's do it right here. Let's see, I'm directing traffic. 
I don't really need to do that. Let's see. Can we just check you out? Hey! Hey, you bit. Uh, I am Superman! Okay, this is one of those rough around the edges things. But anyway, yeah. You can turn over a car if you walk onto it the right way. Uh, let's get traffic cones and try this again. Alright, let's see what this car does here. How are you doing? MVPD, stop the vehicle. Yes. So let's check everything. There's no problem with this vehicle. She's a breathalyzer. She's clean. Alright. She's free to go. Thank you, ma'am. Alright, so that counted. Yep, that was road check one. So now we just need to wait for uh, more vehicles. MVPD, stop the vehicle. We pull him over. Oh god, he just crashed into that. Ah, found a problem. His vehicle's expired license, our uh, expired license, and his broken lights. Are you drunk? Nope. Alright, that's okay. We can give him a ticket. And you're free to go. You see that there, I wrote... Somebody ran over our little cone. MVPD, stop the vehicle. Oh, you was going to try to run over me. Ah, uh, he has broken lights. Are you drunk? No. Nope. Theoretically, I think that's illegal, but we'll give him a ticket. And you're free to go. All right, let's let's pick up these cones. That's my cone, you bastard. I would like that back. Let's see if we can go track down our cone up here, bastard. Guess I'm gonna run lights. You still have my cone? I don't think so. Okay, maybe we have it back. Alright, let's go to the police station. I'd like to turn off my turn signal. There we go. I really don't pay attention to the laws uh, because, well, I'm a cop. They don't apply to me. Alright, so here's our police station. The Mountain Valley Police Department. I don't need to run right now. We can go in here. Let's enter. Ah. And really, there's not much in here. You could use the computer. You can check your same emails that you can check at home. Um, sometimes I can't tell if the sirens are in this game or they're actually on outside my window. Um, you can buy ammo for your gun. I have not had to shoot anybody yet, so I guess that's a good thing. And you can ask for a warrant. But other than that, you really have to go to the police ranks if you want to unlock some other things. Looks like the weather. So if I hit F1, you can see my missions. F2 tells you the current one. Oh my god, they want me to do six roadblocks now. And then you can see my, my rank right now is police officer. Um... And you can move up the ladder, so to speak. And, uh, it's pretty cool. Pretty cool thing. Now, let's just stop right here. And we'll start another a uh, roadblock. People are going to fucking hate us right now. MVPD, stop the vehicle. Yep. Let's see what you got going on here, guy. Because I'm the new dick in town. Ah, oh, there's no problem. Let's see. Oh, no, he's clean. Alright, have a great day. I'll move these cones.
MVPD. Stop the vehicle. Let's see what you're doing. Oh, no problem. Looks like she's doing alright. Okay, you're free to go. What's that? MVPD. Stop the vehicle. Let's double check this guy here. I thought that I'd have a more exciting first day on the job, but uh Oh, we found it. He's got broken lights. Holy shit! Holy crap! Um. Um. Let's give him a ticket. Oh my god. Um. You, up there. MVPD. Stop the vehicle. Holy shit. Uh, he was speeding. Yes. Expired license. Are you drunk? No. Okay, well, I'm going to give you a ticket. Oh my god. Right. MVPD, stop the vehicle. Yeah, you're hitting this dude too. You need... Oh, you're the same guy. Oh, what's he... What's he got? Crown the problem with this vehicle, but it didn't tell me what. Alright, well, we'll give him a ticket. And, uh, you know, get out of here. And then we should be able to do... MVPD, stop the vehicle. Yeah, this is not how cops really function. This was one thing. Hey, baby. I'll let you have a different kind of breathalyzer. Oh, no brake lights. Ah. Uh, let's give you a ticket. Because you don't know how to drive here. And uh, <laughs> I'd like to give her a breathalyzer. Have a great day. All right, let's uh, let's get out of the road before we die, since we almost did die. All right, so what do we what do we accomplish so far? Uh, two missions completed. We've used seven breathalyzers. We've stopped nine vehicles. Uh, we've not killed any innocent people or arrested innocent people. Um, so yeah, so far we're doing great. We've got a little bit of time till the end of our shift, but uh, so far we're doing good. So let's just uh, drive around and see what we can get into. I wish I could use a radar detector and, uh, you know, see what they're up to, but... Eh. Now see, there's one thing I got wrong, if you just noticed. It's like, if I stop... Sometimes the car will just, it's its in reverse and it starts rolling backwards. Alright, but uh, we'll see if anything else pops up by the end of our shift. Maybe something exciting. Oh, I guess it's nighttime again. So I'll turn my, is that my brights? No, that's my brights. Well, let's go, people. Places to go, people to see. Just patrolling the streets of Mountain Valley. Officer Abe Johnson. Let's see if we can find anything. They got kind of look. They kind of both look like they're swerving. But I can't really say anything. We have a call to arrest a murderer. Oh, well, this sounds great. Alright. Let's see if we know where he's at on the map. Oh, we do. Alright, here's where we earn our paycheck, people. This is the music's kicking in. Get out of the way. Going after a murderer. down there. Oh, this could be day. Oh, I see a car. Alright, this could be really dangerous. Alright, we have a 
gonna call to arrest a murder. There are criminals behind away in the populated areas. And let's not fall. Let's sneak down through here. Oh, of course it starts raining. This doesn't make a bad omen or anything. Oh yeah, I can end my shift, huh? There's a car. Oh, there's a person. I wonder how close I need to get to him to yell him down. Should we go in here with a taser or a gun? Let's pull my taser out right now. Police, show me your hands. Oh, we dropped something. Yeah. Yeah, what do we got here? What are you doing, buddy? What do you got? What is that? That's what I thought. Alright, let's frisk him. He's wanted by the police. Let's check his ID. Arnold Wright. Let's go ahead and arrest him. Alright, so what do we have here? Car. Well, let's get this towed. So let's call a tow truck. Report. Now I don't like this. You you got everything towed, but they need to add something where they'll come pick it up. Um, hopefully that's just a a thing. And here, I could walk him back to my car and take him to the police station. But again, I'm just gonna radio in for them to come pick him up. Report. And they will, and I get a perfect score for that. He goes to jail, and my shift is over. Now, theoretically, if you have your own car, you could take your police cruiser back to the police station. But I think uh, today I'm just going to drive home. We have a report that someone has injured many people on the street. Well, Talk sorry, my shift's oh. over. Somebody else can have that. Car 26 is going off for the day. But anyway, gamers, this was a first look at this. Um, if you would like to see more of Enforcer Police Crime Action, um, let me know in the comments. Uh, I enjoy this game. Um... I don't think I've leveled... Yes, I'm a corporal now. Uh, at Senior Trooper, I can use different vehicles and stuff like that. And beyond that, I have no clue what else happens. But that was a super busy first day. Um, we, we wrote some tickets. We did get to go after a murderer. Um, but we'll have to see. But anyway, let me know what you think. Uh, as always, thanks for watching. And I will see you next time. Good night, gamers.